Look at the front where it says Ames real big. Hi everyone and thanks for tuning into the video. Today we're going to take you back to our trip in December of 2021 at uh, Texas when we were down there visiting Kayla's family for the holidays. Here it is just shortly after Christmas now when I'm filming this uh, and putting the video together. Uh, while we were out there I didn't have the time to do the intro where we were at but in this video we go to Mineral Wells and we go to this place called Witch Shorkies Antiques and Collectibles and Furniture Shop. It's located right at 213 North Oak Ave, right in the heart of town, not far from the infamous Baker Hotel. The owner of the store is a personal friend of Kayla's mother and uh, invited us to come in there and let me do a video to show you everything that they have in this pretty awesome store. While it's on the smaller side, they have a lot of vintage antiques from all kinds of different things, from clothing, to decor just to knickknacks and since it was christmas time there was a big emphasis on vintage christmas items which i haven't seen since my grandparents were alive so it was pretty cool to go in there and you'll see a personal item that kayla's mom donated to mark's shop and uh, it's i'm really excited to share that with you guys and while we were there i actually ended up finding a couple of goodies that i brought home myself so anyway i'll be quiet now from here Let's go down to Mineral Wells, Texas, and go to Witch Shorkies Antiques, Collectibles, and Furniture. Well, look at all the goodies out front. I like the Joy of the World painting. The wall art there. Look at that old fan. The old bicycle. They have a lot of cool stuff out here. The old speed limit sign. <laughs> There's another one, Road Work Ahead. The old furniture. Antiques ahead. Collectibles. Look at all the plates up there. Lining up the whole wall. That is cool. Antiques collectibles. Oh, this is so cool. Let's go inside. The old die cast. Jimmy Johnson. Old Hot Wheels. Wow. Oh, look at the Christmas stuff. Good Christmas goodies. Vintage. Look at these old ornaments. My parents have stuff like that. Well, my mom still does. Barney. <laughs> my gosh, let's check this place out. This store is awesome. Christmas tree bulbs. Oh, for those little porcelain trees. A lot of Christmas goodies. Look at the kitty. More die cast. PT Hey, look here. Here's Nate's old car. <laughs> Hi, Kaylee. Every time we go somewhere, our hair's different. Look at those old Christmas lights. Okay? Merry Christmas. Wow. Thank you. Perks of coming to an old store like that. Look at these old, sh these old, old ornaments in here. Wow. Very cool. Nativity figures like the tree it's Christmas time you never know what you'll find in here too and this is my first time in here tolls hardware doorknobs lots of doorknobs oh we got plates you know I like looking at plates old Texas ones oh, he has a lot of them too I have a bunch of Texas plates now that's really old Oh, can't get it back in there. There we go. Wow. I like collecting Texas plates. They look cool. These ones look really cool, but my favorite one was this design here with the space shuttle. Very cool. They got cowboy hats too. Look at that. This black one. I wonder if it would fit me. Probably not. Let's try it. That's a little too small. I have a big head. That's okay. It's Thursday when we're here doing this. My Steelers play tonight, so. 
goes to yours. What's up with this Indian? So that is the Indian that my mom sold to Mark, the owner of the shop. He used to, um, he was a present to my mom because my mom really loves Native mm -hmm. American culture. So yes, this actually used to be in our house. That's cool. And yes, it used to creep everybody out, but <laughs> I grew up around it, so it didn't bother me. That's funny. <laughs> That's cool, I used though. I like to put his wig on, though, because it reminded me of, like, a metalhead. <laughs> so you could look like Alice Cooper. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed this, too. The big mouth billy bass. I can't believe even that it still exists. The fact that any of them still exist. And what else did I see? The owl. We have the same owl. Well, we did. We had it in our garden. I think one of the floods wiped it out, though. We lost a lot of things in those floods. A lot of taxidermy goodies. The goats, I love those. I like Get that. Mm-hmm. The little crates. That's cool. Let's see what else we got. We got a lot of hardware. Fishing boards. Gifts. <laughs> What's back here? Wow. A lot of hardware. A lot of doors. That's pretty cool, though, because you never know what you're going to find in here. There's a little bit of everything. There's a pumpkin. Dr. Pepper. Be a pepper. <laughs> Very cool. Look at this old Westinghouse fan. That's the one you turn it on. You'll cut your hands off. I found more license plates. I love collecting these plates. I think I got all the designs, though. Look, there's an Oklahoma one in there. <laughs> That's cool. I used to have a bunch more. Now I have a bunch of Texas ones and North Carolina ones. That's cool. Should get a plate for every state that I visit, which would be over half the country at this point. All right, let's go on back here. Oh, check this out. The Simpsons uh, Jack in the Box. And the, uh, and the uh, RC car. Very cool. Oh my gosh. Look at these old cameras. Look at these. Wow, that one. The Polaroid. My grandma had one of these. The One Steps. We had one of these, too. Oh, my gosh. What a step back in time. Oh, look. Here's more. Wow, look at this one. I don't have that one. I think I'm going to have to buy that. That's cool. So among looking at the plates, I saw this immediately sticking out the Ohio Bicentennial. So now we're getting up into my neck of the woods there, up near PA. Got old Oklahoma ones, old California plates, New Mexico, Florida. Look at that old Oklahoma. I remember when they looked like that. This one's cool. I wonder if I could find the matching other one for it. They have more in here too. Wow. Hey, what are these ones? apportioned very cool Colorado wow did they ever change their plates up guess not moving on to the back of the store look at all the cookie cutters wow if you need a cookie cutter for any occasion here you go look here's a turkey one or a chicken one <laughs> oh my gosh my grandma was still alive she would have a field day with those refreshing coca-cola shelves very cool Look at the little bobbleheads. That's cool. They're not bobbleheads. They're just little figures. They have quilts. Look back here. A nice. Like, Want to play Scrabble? <laughs> oh, look at these Christmas dolls up here. Santa. Very cool. This store is awesome. They have a lot of stuff here. More plates. Boy, they have a lot. I like the seashells. Now we're talking Outer Banks. Kayla, you said you found an old Pizza Hut picture. Where's that at? Let's find that. It's in this general area, I believe. It's actually right behind those cups. Oh, I see it way back there. Look at that. That's a beer pitcher there, buddy. That's cool. Look at the old Waffle House one, too. Mm -hmm. I might have to buy that Pizza Hut picture. <laughs> they had an old Burger King cup when we first came in the door. I'll show you that when we get back up front. I might have to get that picture, though. That picture's cool. Look, they got records in here, too. Lots of vinyl. The perk of coming in here. Hey, look at that creepy Santa. That one's scary. And he's got this pause up there that they're getting better. No, they look like they're getting ready to kill me in my sleep. And my mom has this monkey right behind 
Conway. Conway Twitty. Huh? My mom has that monkey. Oh yeah, I recognize that. I I remember seeing that in the house. <laughs> That's cool. Sticks. Oh boy. Oh look, that's a nice telescope. Very cool. Pizza Inn? Isn't that a lo local place? Um, it's a chain. We just don't have them here anymore. Oh. That's cool. I, think okay pizza, from what I, remember. I never got I never even heard of them until I came down here. Wow. A lot of uh dishware, ornaments, breakable ornaments. Look at the little figurines. Oh, look at these ornaments. Now, these are definitely older than me. Look at the E.T. one. Look at that. That is cool. A lot of Christmas ornaments. It is Christmas time. Oh, my God. My grandmother had a lamp like this. My dad's mom. She had one exactly like that. Kind of creeped me out when I was a kid. It was kind of scary to me. <laughs> I don't know why. I <laughs> uh, love the old style ornaments. That is cool as heck. Hmm. You also have a Taco Bell really? Mm -hmm. Macho mug, Pac-Man. Where's that Chihuahua at? I want to see it. It's up near the front. The okay. Break the I just found some Shrek. We love you, Daddy. Oh, God. Look at the Shrek. face Leah makes. Yeah, Leah makes Leah that. Leah makes that face. Look at this. Look at this Rudolph ornament. Look how cute that is. That's awesome. Okay. Here's the Burger King one. This is the Burger King one I was telling you guys about. Check that out. That's vintage. Very cool. Now let's go back here again. I saw a mag light. I might have to check that mag light out. Where is it? Oh my god. Yep. And this my it really is the Taco Bell my one. My grandmother had these dogs. Mm -hmm. Like there were a few of them with the series. And you press it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have no idea what he's singing. I don't either. That's, That's cool. cool. <laughs> Look at the Ronald, the Ronald buddy bag. That's old school too. Mm -hmm. All right, now I'm blown away because I know like hell, you guys don't sell this down here. Iron City beer. Look at all the Iron City cans. Look, there's one back there. So now we got Pittsburgh in mineral wells. All right, a lot of Iron City cans. <laughs> More license plates too. I love checking out these old license plates like this. I like that one, but it was a little. A little dented for my liking. I mean, it's alright. I have a bunch of dents in my head, too. I mean, look at me. <laughs> look how I am. Just teasing. Ooh, I like this. It's like a block where you can, like, twist the outfits and stuff. <laughs> uh-huh. That's cool. That's cool. Well, I don't see another plate like that one. That one was awesome. It was very... Oh, there's an old New York plate. I like like I like looking at Look these at old where ones. This is from Food Avenue Target. This was given away in like the Target Kids meals. Yeah. You guys can see it. That's yeah, barely. Target would never do that anymore. <laughs> no, Target's not cool. Kellogg's raisin brand. <laughs> this is a very very cool store. These old board games. Silly Safari, Snow White, Pin the Tail on a Donkey, Table Tennis. Wow. Old die cast. Old silverware. Vintage silverware. Very cool store. Lots of books. Cookbooks. These are, they got lots of cookbooks. As I was uh, showing everything up there, gotta put recognition on the Pee Wee's Playhouse playset. I've never seen the playset before. I've seen the houses and the figures, but never, the, I didn't even know the playset existed. I knew, but it, I haven't seen one, I mean, for Matchbox yet. Oh my gosh. That's incredible. <laughs> yeah. Old Mobile One truck. Let's see what's in here. We didn't go through this section yet. I did see that old die cast, that old NASCAR race car. State of Perfection. QT Pie. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these old jackets. 
Look at that. How about that? Beanie Baby Boulevard Coca-Cola. Look at that old Cracker Jack game. Wow, that's oldie. Very cool. Very nice store. Look at these old vintage clothing. Little vests. Wow. This place is awesome. So this is the Pizza Hut picture that I was showing you guys a little bit earlier. I am buying this. Be a pepper. Dr. You're welcome, pepper. Kayla. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Kayla. Look at her new hair, everybody. She did it, got the blonde bangs. Blonde and blue, baby. Looking cute. <laughs> associate me with the Dallas Cowboys. No. Okay, so I didn't even see this side first. Look at the instruments. They have a banjo, a couple guitars. Very cool. And I saw something else I'm buying. Check this out. Union Pacific. It's five bucks. I'm buying that. As a matter of fact, looking at the other ones, okay, so I got the Union Pacific one in my hand here. I'm buying that along with that Pizza Hut mug, okay? Just gotta put that down on the floor here. Be careful with that. Five dollars, okay? Oops, sorry. Here's the other Union Pacific one, and then check that out. Burlington Northern. I'm buying that one too. I, th I should just buy all three. There's a little spider on it, but I don't care. I'm buying this one too. Look at the goodies by the front desk. I like the Texas wall art up there. That I would like to buy. I just don't know how much it is. I'm sure it's a lot. Look at these old cups in here. Time for a pizza break. Pizza Inn. Never went to Pizza Inn. First National Bank Mineral Wells. Uh -huh. PBR. Wow, Dallas Cowboys, old 8-track tapes, very cool, this store is awesome. Look at these old postcards too, local postcards. Here's one with the largest watermelon ever. I like these old postcards. Did you turn off my music? No, I didn't. I like it. <laughs> That's cool. Up by the front desk, check this out. Old cassette recorder. I have about, oh, I don't know, about seven, eight of these at home. I used to collect them. I have a bunch. I wouldn't mind getting another one, but I don't, I need to, com I need to keep my composure. Lots of old pins. Bottle openers, can openers. Very cool. Look at that, guys. You can have your own payphone. Wow. <laughs> that is something else. I didn't even step back here. I'm in the back of the store again. Look at that old TV. Wow. Wind chimes. Texas A&M. What a cool little store. You definitely need to check this out. If you're into vintage collectibles, you definitely have to come here and check out Mark's shop. This store is pretty awesome. As I kick things accidentally and break them. No, I'm just kidding. What a cool, cool store. I like a lot. Very, very awesome. Look at the old PlayStation 2. It just, I just saw that off the side of my eye there. Look at that. There's a step back in time. Here's another payphone. No coin needed. It's for collect calls only. Wow. I have a bucket full of old horseshoes. You'll find plenty of them out here with how many horses and livestock you see out here in Texas. Especially where we're at. Hope you enjoyed that video, everyone. What I didn't show you on camera, too, were actually two uh, credit cards, vintage credit cards, one from Sears and another one from Neiman Marcus, which I actually picked up for just a couple of bucks each. Uh, prices on everything there are very comparable to what other antique and vintage stores offer, and Mark was a very friendly guy. I highly recommend if you're ever in Mineral Wells, Texas, or ever pass through it or are near that area, stop in and check out his store. He's open up most days of the week. Uh, usually from 9 a.m. until about 4 or 5, I believe. 
if I'm not mistaken. I think he's closed on Sundays, though. But he has a very wonderful store, very nice guy, uh, family-run business. Tell him we sent you and uh, support them. They always get something new in all the time, whether it's, like I said, whether it's tools, clothes, knickknacks, dishware, Christmas items, or, in my case, locomotives, and a Pizza Hut pitcher and those two credit cards. They have all kinds of books, history on mineral wells, the Baker Hotel, you name it. You'll find just about a little bit of everything. What we couldn't go through was all the furniture. I know his store is a little bit bigger than uh, what we were able to go through, but I'm happy to have put that together for you anyway. It's an awesome place. Highly recommend again. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to give the video a like. If you're not a subscriber, feel free to subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. We're always filming all kinds of different things. You never know what we'll film and when. And, well, we'll talk to you later. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. Take care, stay awesome. And on Kayla's behalf, have a what Shorky's delicious day. I guess that's kind of bizarre, but it sounds cool. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye. <laughs>